The Yugoslavia national football team represented the Kingdom of Yugoslavia 1918-1941, until 1929 as Kingdom of Serbs, Croats and Slovenes, and the Socialist Federal Republic of Yugoslavia 1943-1992, until November 29, 1945 as Democratic Federal Yugoslavia, the 29th of November 1945-1963 as Federal People's Republic of Yugoslavia in association football. It enjoyed success in international competition. In 1992, during the Yugoslav Wars, the team was suspended from international competition as part of a United Nations sanction. In 1994, when the boycott was lifted, it was succeeded by the Federal Republic of Yugoslavia national football team. The Serbia national football team inherited Yugoslavia's spot within FIFA and UEFA and is considered by both organizations as the only successor of Yugoslavia. History The first national team was in the kingdom that existed between the two world wars. The football federation of what was then the Kingdom of Serbs, Croats and Slovenes was founded in Zagreb in 1919 under the name Jugoslavenski Nogometni Savez and admitted into FIFA, and the national team played its first international game at the Summer Olympics in Antwerp in 1920. The opponent was Czechoslovakia, and the historic starting eleven that represented Kingdom of SCS on its debut were, Dragutin Verduka, Vekoslav Zapanzik, Yaroslav Seifer, Stanko Taucher, Slavin Sindrik, Rudolf Rupets, Dragutin Vragovic, Artur Dubravchik, Emil Perska, Ivan Granik, and Jovan Ružić. They lost by a huge margin 0-7, but nonetheless got their names in the history books. Topic: 1930 World Cup. In 1929, the country was renamed to Yugoslavia, and the football association became Fudbalski Savez Jugoslavi and moved its headquarters to Belgrade. The national team participated at the 1930 FIFA World Cup, finishing in fourth place. In its first ever World Cup match in Montevideo's Park Central, Yugoslavia managed a famous 2-1 win versus Mighty Brazil, with the following starting eleven representing the country, Milovan Jaksic, Bronislav Sikulic, Aleksandr Tirnanik, Militan Ivkovic, Ivica Bek, Momčilo Dokic, Blagoj Marjanovic, Milorad Arsenijevic, Dord Vujadinovic, Dragoslav Mihailovic, and Lubisa Stefanovic. The team was the youngest squad at the inaugural World Cup at an average age of just under 22 years old, and became quite popular amongst the Uruguayan public, who dubbed them, Los Ichachos. The national team consisted of players based in Serbian football clubs, while the Zagreb Subassociation forbid players from Croatian clubs, some of whom were regulars in the national team until then, to play in the World Cup due to the relocation of football association's headquarters from Zagreb to Belgrade. Silver medal at 1948 Summer Olympics Yugoslavia began their football campaign by defeating Luxembourg 6–1, with five different players scoring the goals. In the quarter-finals and the semi-finals, they would take out Turkey and Great Britain by the same score of 3–1. In the final though, they would lose to Sweden. Silver medal at 1952 Summer Olympics Having a team with many players from the 1948 generation, Yugoslavia was a formidable side at the 1952 Summer Olympics and finished as runners-up behind the famous «Golden Team» representing Hungary. Against the USSR, Yugoslavia was 5–1 up with 15 minutes of their first round match to go. The Yugoslavs, understandably, put their feet up. Arthur Ellis, the match referee, recorded what happened next in his book, The Final Whistle London, 1963. The USSR forced the most honorable draw ever recorded. Sevalid Bobrov, their captain, scored a magnificent hat-trick. After the USSR had reduced the lead to 5-2, he, almost single-handed, took the score to 5-5, scoring his third in the last minute. For once, use of the word sensational was justified. Although Bobrov's early goal in their replay presaged a miraculous recovery, Yugoslavia recovered sufficiently to put out their opponents easily in the second half. Topic: 
Topic: <laughs> Later decades. The federation and football overall was disrupted by World War II. After the war, a socialist federation was formed and the Football Federation reconstituted. It was one of the founding members of the UEFA and it organized the 1976 European Championship played in Belgrade and Zagreb. The national team participated in eight World Cups and four Euros, won the Olympic football tournament in 1960 at the Summer Games they also finished second three times and third once, and developed a reputation for skillful and attacking football, leading them to be dubbed the Brazilians of Europe. Dragan Zajic holds the record for the most national team caps at 85, between 1964 and 1979. The best scorer is Stjepan Bobic with 38 goals, between 1946 and 1956. <laughs> <laughs> Dissolution and UN embargo With the end of the Cold War, democratic principles were introduced to the country which brought about the end of Titoist rule. In the subsequent atmosphere, national tensions were heightened. At the Yugoslavia-Netherlands friendly in preparation for the 1990 World Cup, the Croatian crowd in Zagreb jeered the Yugoslav team and anthem and waved Dutch flags owing to its resemblance to the Croatian tricolor. With the dissolution of Yugoslavia, the team split up and the remaining team of the Federal Republic of Yugoslavia was banned from competing at Euro 92. The decision was made on May 31, 1992, just ten days before the competition commenced. They had finished top of their qualifying group, but were unable to play in the competition due to United Nations Security Council Resolution 757. Their place was taken by Denmark, who went on to win the competition. Yugoslavia had also been drawn as second seed in Group 5 of the European Zone in the qualifying tournament for the 1994 World Cup. Fry was barred from competing, rendering the group unusually weak. <laughs> <laughs> Breakup After the breakup of Yugoslavia, the Fry consisted of Montenegro and Serbia. The national team of Serbia and Montenegro continued under the name Yugoslavia until 2003, when country and team were renamed Serbia and Montenegro. For the later official football teams, see Bosnia and Herzegovina national football team member of UEFA and FIFA since 1990s Croatia national football team member of UEFA and FIFA since 1990s Slovenia national football team member of UEFA and FIFA since 1990s Republic of Macedonia national football team member of UEFA and FIFA since 1990s Serbia and Montenegro national football team considered successor of Yugoslavia later Montenegro national football team member of UEFA and FIFA since 2006 Serbia national football team considered successor of Serbia and Montenegro Kosovo national football team member of UEFA and FIFA since 2016 Topic national teams Topic successor teams Both FIFA and UEFA consider the Serbian national team to be the direct and sole successor of the Yugoslavia Kingdom of Yugoslavia, SFR Yugoslavia and FR Yugoslavia and Serbia and Montenegro national football teams. The teams of other republics were inducted as fully new members. Additional stats Croatia has, will appear at their 10th major tournament since independence, most by any other former republic. Croatia's runner-up finish at 2018 FIFA World Cup is the best result at a major tournament by any other former republic. Croatia was the first former Yugoslav nation to qualify to a major tournament after independence. Slovenia has only qualified for major tournaments via playoffs 3. Croatia were seeded inside pot 1 of FIFA World Cup qualifications on three successive occasions, in 2010, 2014 and 2018 FIFA World Cup qualifiers, after FR Yugoslavia who were seeded once in 2002 FIFA World Cup qualification. 
Only three former Yugoslav republics were ever seated inside pot 1 in the history of UEFA European Championship qualifying competition after FR Yugoslavia UEFA Euro 2000 qualifying, Croatia UEFA Euro 2012 qualifying and Bosnia Euro 2016 qualifying. No former SFR Yugoslav Republic was ever seated or in pot 1 at finals of a major tournament. Niko Kronchar played for Croatia at 2006 FIFA World Cup under his father, head coach Zlatko Kronchar, likewise Tino Sven Susic played for Bosnia at 2014 FIFA World Cup under his uncle, head coach Safit Susic. <laughs> Youth teams The under-21 team won the inaugural UEFA U21 Championship in 1978. The Yugoslav under-20 team won the FIFA World Youth Championship 1987. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Kit history. Topic: <laughs> 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 Kit sponsorship. All of the kits from 1950 to 1990 are sponsored by Adidas. Topic: Kingdom. Topic: SFRY. Topic: Competitive record. Topic FIFA World Cup record Champions runners up third place fourth place Topic UEFA European Championship record Champions runners up third place fourth place Asterisk denotes draws including knockout matches decided on penalty kicks Topic Mediterranean Games record Topic Honors This is a list of honors for the senior Yugoslav national football team FIFA World Cup Fourth place two nineteen thirty one nine six two UEFA European Championship Runner up 2 1960 1968 Fourth place 1 1976 Olympic football tournament Gold medal 1 1960 Silver medal 3 1948 1952 1956 Bronze medal 1 1984 Topic Most capped players Topic Head to head record Positive record Neutral record Negative record Topic Head coaches Topic See also Related articles List of Yugoslavia international footballers List of Yugoslavia national football team goalscorers Yugoslavia national football team games Yugoslavia national under-21 football team Yugoslavia national under-20 football team Successor team Serbia and Montenegro national football team Bosnia and Herzegovina national football team Croatia national football team Kosovo national football team Macedonia national football team Montenegro national football team Serbia national football team considered the only official successor of Yugoslavia by FIFA and UEFA Slovenia national football team equals equals notes